hey, check it out. You want to play minor in second position? You don't need to buy a minor tuned harmonica, man. Come, come here, come check it out. You don't even need to know how to play it on any particular minor scale, man. Dig this. You don't have to do it in third position. All you have to do is know how to bend the three draw a little bit. Don't tell anyone. Hey everybody and welcome back to Free Fridays. It's gonna be another great day because today we're gonna learn about how to play in second position but minor. Now I got lots of videos on minor scales and all of those videos will get you going playing minor in that scale. But today we're going to narrow it down to the one single ingredient that makes your playing work over minor chords or minor keys. And that ingredient is what we call the minor third. And we're going to be doing it in second position, not third position, not on a minor tuned harmonica, on a regular Honer Marine band. This one's from Blue Moon from my man Tom Halchek. All right, but it's still a regular tuned marine band. So we're gonna take a listen to how this minor third affects the music in making it work over minor chords, minor keys, and we're gonna play anything we want on the harmonica, just keeping that one note flat. Here we go, here we go, here we go. All right. I got me an A harmonica. I was playing over a Quist backing track, it's linked below, in the key of E minor on an A harp. Now a lot of times people think you need to have a minor tuned harmonica. The how I got the idea for this video is somebody wrote, wow, you're playing in a minor key on a regular harmonica? That's really hard. I was thinking to myself, you know, it's not as hard as you think. And then I was thinking, well, look at all the videos I have on playing in minor scales, harmonic minor, Dorian minor, Aeolian, right? All these different scales, all of these different scales. And I thought, you know, I don't think I've ever made a video that talks about the only thing that you have to do to play minor. You just need to bend the three draw and you need to keep it bent. You cannot hit the three draw natural and always keep that note bent a little bit, just a half step, you're good. You don't need to know any other scale. You don't need to know any scale. All you have to do is keep the three draw bent. Every other note you work will fit into some perfect minor melodic possibility. Just keep the three draw half step bent. Hey, did you see that cat back there? Cool, very cool. Here's what we wanna do right here so if i don't bend it it sounds like this oakley doakley if i bend it hear how it's just a little bit darker that darkness that sadness that spookiness those are adjectives that we equate with the term minor if i keep that note bent it's called a minor third. It's a third that has been flatted, but we call it a minor third because it has to be there to make the song minor. The band is already in a minor key. You have to be there to play in the minor key with them. If you don't, it will sound really bad. Let's listen. So I got my Jason Ritchie signature mic here, just to amplify <laughs> how bad this is gonna sound. So the notes that I want to avoid one more time are just three draw and seven draw. Now I don't want to hit the 10 draw half step bend, but that note's harder to hit on purpose than it is by accident. <laughs> so let's take a listen. Songs in E minor, I'm on an A harp. This is why they've sold so many minor key harmonicas. Right, you hear that? It does not 
not sound good. So let's hear it where it sounds okay. Just bend it a half step. seven draw and ten draw half step back. Now, for all you overblowers, that's why the sixth overblow is so important. It's your minor third in the second octave. for tuning in to free Fridays right here on YouTube. Subscribe today. Click the subscribe button for hundreds of free harmonica lessons. If you like what I'm putting down and you'd like to support the cause, go the extra mile. Be sure to visit my Patreon page. Patreon patrons, thank you very much. You're making these lessons an absolute priority in my life, no matter how busy I get. A free lesson happens every Friday. For as low as a dollar a month, that's 25 cents a lesson, you can become a Patreon patron. If you're doing a little better and you can donate more, that's great. Every time you become a Patreon patron, you're helping somebody else out there that doesn't have a credit card, that doesn't have a dollar a month to continue to get free harmonica instruction and much, much more. Remember, we got product reviews here on this channel. We do videos on addiction and bipolar disorder. We got blues stories. We got performance videos and everything right here on Jason Rich's YouTube. Subscribe today. I'd like to thank Honer Harmonicas. And I'd like to thank Blue Moon Harmonicas, making custom parts for any harmonica that you might have at home. Blue Moon has got you. The Lone Wolf Blues Company, pedals, amplifiers, microphones, you name it, much more. Right here out of Louisiana, the Lone Wolf Blues Company is bringing you the best in customer service for almost any kind of amplified blues harmonica needs that you may have. Speaking of amplifiers, harp gear amplifiers, check them out. The very best harp gear right out of Ocala, Florida. 
I got a website, www.mooncat.org. Check me out on mooncat.org. I got tour dates happening all over the place. I'm going all over the country this year, playing tour dates with J.J. Appleton, with Damon Fowler, with J.P. Soares, with my own band, with Joe Crown, all kinds of people. www.mooncat.org. T-shirts, lesson information, all of that. Thank you guys so very much for tuning in. We do this every single Friday, and then every now and then I throw you some more stuff right here at Jason Richie's YouTube. A moon cat, love and appreciate all y'all. Thank you.